Okay, so rules are meant to be broken, and breaking of a rule is what I did. Hey you guys, this is Dawn Does Life, and today I'm unboxing another Diamond Art Club diamond painting. This one, I hope you'll understand, but I will tell you, I was able to use all points except for under $10 to uh, buy this. There was this one and one other one that I got, and... I paid less than $10 plus shipping for this. So I'm quite satisfied <laughs> with the breaking of the rule in this case because I've been waiting for these for a while. But I'm just going to show you one today and the other one will be coming shortly. So square diamond painting and it is... Dun, 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 dun. I'm so excited you guys. I got... Can you see it? <laughs> it's... I got May May Don't Give Me No Sass. And yes, you're right. I could not turn it down. I also will say this is the second time I filmed it because my first time my file was corrupted. Uh, it seemed like it recorded just fine and then when I took it downstairs there was nothing I could do to get that thing to work. I couldn't even get it to open so here we go again. So I'm showing you what I've what I got and I'm showing you the canvas and I'm showing you the drills. All right oh looks like when I put it back in I scrunched it a bit. That was me, not them. So first one, yeah, there is the sticker. I'm actually gonna just bring this down a little bit. There is the sticker. She's so cute. So this one is 20 by 27 inches or 50.8 centimeters by 68.7 centimeters. And before we open up the canvas, I'm just gonna show you the drill kit really quick. It is a standard kit, black pen, black squishy. You've got your baggie, so you do not have to kit up if you don't want to, you can work out of the baggies. You've got your four and seven placer, two plates of heart-shaped wax, and this washi tape, which I actually think it's really cute. And then this cover minder, and what is this? It's a little flower, very tiny, but it's so, so cute. So that's what the toolkit comes with. Uh, no tweezers for a square, that's weird. No, you know what, I'm sorry, I did get tweezers and I put them up in the thing. I was like, I thought I got tweezers. I did get tweezers, but I put them away right away. So I'm just gonna stick this all back in here. You guys, I am not feeling good today, so sorry. Um, it seems like I have this horrific cold and I just can't stop coughing and the congestion is just awful. Okay, let's get this out of here. Let's get the drills and the paperwork. So big bag of drills. Uh, this one has, oh, it looks like I bent this too, uh, 59 colors and what's cool is there are four ABs and one, uh, I think they called it iridescent drill and that's this code down here with the L symbol. So we will we will take a look at that and then you also get your book just on some tips on how to diamond paint if you haven't before and there's also another uh, discount code in there. So I'm going to stick the drills off to the side so we can look at this gorgeous gorgeous canvas. Oh you guys. So it is a little bit bung bunged up here, but that's because I bent it um, when I was putting it back in the box. I'm not sure why I did that, but or how I did that, but I did. First time I took it out, it was fine. Look at this painting. I am so excited. So this uh, artist is, I always say it wrong. So this artist is, um, it's May May, Don't Give Me No Sass by Richard Lorenz. I absolutely love this guy's paintings. Uh, he has got a whole series on birds and every single one of them is like comical and cute. And I've just been wanting one for so long. I still, the one I wanted was the one with the two on it and with the saying um, next to you is or you next to me is right where I want to be or something like that. Me next to you, next to me. Um, I love that painting, but that one I have not seen come back in stock. And that's okay because this one is as a fairly new release. I just got it in. And I had the points and I thought, you know what, I'm jumping on the train. 
So Diamond Art Club, their canvases at the top, do what makes you sparkle with the um, scalloped edging so that the canvas does not fray. Also underneath, super soft flocked uh, tarpaulin canvas. It lays down flat really, really quickly. I mean, considering the fact that I crinkled it along here, it's actually laying pretty flat for me already. And look at this girl. I just love her. Look at her. She's like pointing her finger, her wing at you and saying, don't give me no sass. I just, just love it. So let's go down real quick and look at the canvas. I mean, you're not going to be disappointed. The canvas is beautiful. Everything is very readable. Um, I'm not seeing, there's a couple of symbols on here that I haven't seen before. I don't think I've ever seen the star. There's also kind of a wavy pattern. I'll just show you on here the different symbols. There are the symbols, and again, there are 59 on here this time. But this little, uh, where is it? The wavy symbol right here. Never seen that one before. Uh, there's that S with the underline. I've no, I don't think I've seen that one before. There's a couple on here that look a little different. But anyway, they all look good. So I'm going to show you the where where on the canvas you can find the ABs and the iridescent uh, once I show you the drills. But just to show you the bottom of the canvas, so you have your legend at the top left, but then you also have another one at the top, bottom right. And then along the bottom you will see their guarantee, their lifetime guarantee, as well as their social media links and then the information on the artist. So again, the canvas is 20 by 27 inches or 50.8 by 68.7. And then there's a small little thumbnail at the bottom as well. I am so excited that I have this, you guys. I'm very, very, very happy. Looks like there's gonna be some, uh, lots of confetti on here, but that's okay. I can't wait to see what this one looks like done. And now I'm just gonna flip the canvas over so that we can look at the drills. Oh boy, did I ever crinkle that. Jeez, what was I thinking? Okay, let's bring over the drills. All right. Okay, I guess I'm just going to start here. So it looks like we have 498, 920, 37, 21, 107 is one of the ABs. You can see it's like blue and pink and it's just pretty. Uh, we've got 743, 301, 3776, 740, 131 is the second AB, more of an orange color with that extra sparkle. 3823, 814, 321, 782, 451, 3727, 758, 780, 841, 300, and 951. Lots of browns and creams and oranges so far. Next one is... We've got a 310, nine, two bags of 950, two bags of 3858, 3064, 3772, and it looks like there's two bags of that. 152, three bags of 315. I'm getting all twisted up here, guys. Uh, we've got 3041, that's a nice movie color. 225, 3857, 407, 938, 3861, it looks like there is two bags of that. 898. And is this the last one? And on this one, we have 3864, 310. Three more bags of 310, and we already opened one bag, so that's four bags of 310. 452, it looks like we have two bags of 3371. 741, and there is another AB141. Did I miss one in that last package? Is 
did I get all of them? Oh, it looks like there is one more pack here yet to go. Uh, 3815, 3818, some greens. Uh, 824, 3750. Here is the iridescent L3746, kind of a purpley color. And it, it looks kind of like a crystal, but a little cloudier than the crystal drills. That's really pretty. Uh, 471, 890, 783, 37, 99, 947, 921, 37, 22, 402, 935, 937, 918, 378, 319, 400, and 108. Pretty green, AB. Nice. Okay. Gonna just stick these off to the side. And then let's look on the canvas where we can find each of these ABs. Oh, you guys, this canvas is gorgeous. Okay. So first one is the red AB number one. And I see it in through the decoration in her hat. Um, kind of sporadically in through there. Do I see any more? I'm not seeing it. I see a little bit of it in her necklace, uh, just like, again, sporadically in through there, and a little bit in her toes at the bottom here. Whoops, let's just move that up. There's a little bit in through the toes. Uh, the next one is number two, and it's the green one, and I'm seeing it again in the hat, um, all throughout the hat. Uh, at the end of the flower there. I also see it in her nose. And also in her feet, in her toes. And then in this uh, necklace that she's hanging, or I think that's a necklace. It looks kind of like a necklace. Uh, I see some hanging there as well. Number three is yellow, and I'm seeing lots of it in this area here around her eyes. I guess not lots of it, but I see some of it. Uh, in through the flowers, and then a little bit in through the hat as well. Um, in her earring here. She's so pretty. I also see a little bit in her toes down here and a little bit in this necklace uh, at the side over here. Okay, and then the next one is number four, and it's the white one. And I do see, again, some in her necklace. I don't see any near the bottom. Uh, in her eye, and lots in through the flowers over here. Hopefully you guys can see all that. Uh, but just in the whites of her eye, if you can call them that, um, I can see a bit there too. And that would be it for that. Now let's check out this iridescent one. Uh, it's kind of a purpley color. The symbol is kind of an A. Where would I see that? I'm looking. I don't see any at the top. I do see some in her earring and in this necklace and then also in this uh, necklace that's hanging down near the bottom I also see some there and that is a little bit over here but that's it so there's not a lot of it um, it'll be interesting to see what it looks like this will be the first time that I do a diamond art club with anything other than ABs so I'm really excited to see how that turns out, um, or interested to see how that's going to turn out. I'm sure it's going to look just beautiful. But oh, you guys, look at this picture. I wish I could get the whole thing in here. Like, let's see if I can raise this at all and get more of it. Like, she's wearing this absolutely insanely crazy hat. She just reminds you of that aunt that you go over to her house and she's like, don't give me no sass. Don't mess with me. 
I love it. It's so pretty. I do think this is one of the largest amounts of uh, colors I've worked with, like 59. Oh, it's so nice though, you guys. So you have to tell me, you guys, have you worked on a Richard Lorenz? If so, which ones have you done so far? Are you just as taken with him as I am? I haven't even done one and I'm totally smitten with these paintings. I want them all. I don't think there's anyone that I don't like. But now I have two and I've shown you one, so I still have one more to go. No, I'm not gonna feel too bad about it because like I said, I, I used all my points to pay for it and only ended up, like the points are in chunks of 10, like $10, 1,000 points, $10. So I had to pay less than $10 and then also I had to pay for my shipping. So I can deal with that for these are like, ugh, so excited. Okay you guys, so Richard Lorenz, May May, don't give me no sass. I just love that. This painting is gorgeous. So glad you guys were here to hang out with me while I unboxed it. And you guys, that's where I'm gonna leave it. Give me a thumbs up if you like the video and then also subscribe if you haven't already. I'd love to have you. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day wherever you are, whenever you're watching this. And until the next video, take care. Bye. Bye, Mimi.